Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, you're still welcome. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave and like this video if you like me and my beauty videos and um, pregnancy vlogs and stuff like that. Set my eyes, prime my eyes, did my eyebrows. Um, so yeah, now I'm just trying to figure out if the tape is matching so that eyeliner is not one up and one down. So I'm like looking over here on my mirror and see if they look good. So as you saw by the title, this look is going to be a full coverage or full glam um, fall makeup tutorial look. And I hope you guys enjoy it. This is my first fall makeup tutorial here on my channel. I did one on my Snapchat. Um, I did a video of a fall on my snapchat my personal snapchat I think it was on my personal snapchat on my beauty snapchat I don't remember but if you want to continue watching me doing my videos or different kind of looks follow me on snapchat just follow me on both snapchats um, I will link them down on the description box below and here on the screen somewhere also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and etc. And yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling and get into the video. So we're going to be, since I don't want to be using gold all the time because I am getting tired of using gold all the time, I'm going with the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, the first one. I have been having this palette for the longest now and I haven't used it as much as I have used the second one which I'm going to be using it as well in this video and I'm going to be using the electric palette as well in this video just one color all the products that I will be using today will be on my description on my description box below so make sure to always um, look at my box so you guys see what products I used and what I'm wearing and what lip color I'm using and all that good stuff. Um, if you see me out of breath a lot, it's because I am pregnant. I'm six months pregnant and the baby is taking like my oxygen away. So yeah, so we're gonna get started. And on this palette, on um, the first palette, we're going to be using a uh, for my for the crease area um let me know if i'm too far from the camera or i'm good like this so you guys can see what i'm doing to my eyes but if not let me move my setup a little closer to me <laughs> so okay i'm going to be using this one like i said and i have my mirror over here just in case i need this one over here um, and I'm going to be using, too bad I can't fold this, but I'm going to be using this color right here and we're going to be putting that on the crease area. When you're putting your eyeshadows on your crease area and stuff like that, always look down or always look straight. Like put your mirror um, not up here if not down and then put your head up a little bit and just look straight down ahead you want to put this color on your crease area until you get the pigment the however you say that word to show up like until you like the color how it's looking and I'm doing circle motions and wiper motions now with the second chocolate bar to face we're going to be using peanut butter which is this color which is more orange than the first one the other one was a lighter orangey color so we're going to be using the same brush because we're going to apply it on the same area but a little bit lower
you want to keep the color that you put first on your crease area um, showing up so whenever you apply other colors make sure it's lower than the first color that you applied <coughs> And for the lid, I'm going to be using another brush and we're going to be using this brush. It's from Urban Decay as well. It doesn't have a name, but I'm pretty sure it's from Urban Decay because they look like that brand. And we're gonna go with the electric palette and we're gonna use the color Slow Burn, which is this color right here. It's like a orange red pink color like it's a weird color like it's not true orange it's like like on the pen it looks orange but when you um, swatch it looks like red you know and we're just going to apply it on the lid area Instead of swiping it, I'm patting it. I'm patting it so I can get the color I want. And then later on, if I want to wet the color, I will wet it. And I want this all over the lid and a little bit on the crease area where my eye folds. Okay, we're gonna um, intensify, I don't know if that's how you say it, intensify the crease area with a darker color. And we're going to be using a different kind of brush. And we're going to be using the e.l.f. blending eye brush, which it looks like this. And we're going to be using, let's see what color, okay. Let's use this brown color here, which looks like that. And we're going to put it on top of the orange red. Now we're gonna go back to that orange color, orange red whatever and we're going to pat the color in a little more now we're gonna do eyeliner we're gonna do two types of eyeliner we're going to be doing the black eyeliner and a silver eyeliner so for the eyeliner, I'm going to be using, we're going to use gold because I don't have silver. I thought I did. I have a gold, so we're just going to put a little bit. So we're going to start with the eyeliner. Sorry, this is not eyeliner. I don't know, where's my head? This is the eyeliner. This is the NYX in the shade black. And it's um, matte so it turns matte you know so I'm gonna do this off camera the eyeliner and I'll be back to show you guys this one okay now I'm going with this gold eyeliner so hopefully it looks good I wanted it to do silver but I don't have silver sorry So please. Ooh, 
I like how this looks. Oh yeah, definitely. All right, we're going to leave the eyes alone for a second and we're gonna jump into our face. In our face, I'm going to use this oil. I haven't seen nobody on YouTube talking about this oil. And it's the Rose Hip Oil Hydrating Oil for your body and your face, wherever you want to put it. Um, so far, I've been trying this oil and this oil has been the bomb. I'm not going to put lotion or anything because the oil, you know, is already hydrated, hydrated, <laughs> hydrated enough. So I'm going to go ahead and jump to foundation. I'm going to be using the Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation in shade 8, Golden Natural, Neutral, however you say that word. I'm going to use the foundation as concealer as well. Now I'm gonna set. Oh. Now I'm gonna set my under eye with the Win Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in the shade Banana. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be using this brush from Shop Miss A. However you say that word. However you say their name. To set my face, I'm going to use the Air Spawn. You guys, I am in love with this eye makeup look. No lie. Okay, now I'm going to contour my face with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit in shade Medium Tan. And... I'm going to use another Real Technique contour brush. No lie, my eyes look like a Hashiro. Like, i never done this makeup look before. And I'm so beyond obsessed with it. Oh, my Lord. Um, bronzer, which I'm going to be using from Revolution. Um, and I'm going to be using this shade right here. It doesn't have a name, so... Okay, now we're going to go with highlight and we're going to be using the Maybelline Master Chrome in shade 100 Molten Gold. 
Wah, papi. What? Yeah. That's my son. He's downstairs because he was sleeping. And I was like, let me take advantage and film for you guys. But he woke up. <laughs> so I keep telling him that I'm going right there, that I'm almost done. So he doesn't get cranky on me and so I could finish um recording for you guys this video is already so long face now we're gonna go back to our eyes i have no lashes so sad i know but we're gonna go back to our eyes. We're gonna finish the lower lash line and we're going to do the same thing we did on the, on the top, on the bottom, but we're only going to be using two shades and that's going to be the very orangey color from the semi-sweet with this brush. It's from Anastasia Beverly Hills and I don't know if it has a name or a number. I don't. So we're going to do that. Now, now we're going to use the same orangey color we used on the top and we're going, we're going in. Um, we're going to put this color very close to our lower lash line. Now I'm going to wet this color so we can um, intensify the color. Okay, and I'm looking for the spray. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'm so in love with this makeup look. Okay, now I'm gonna put um, eyeliner. If I could find it, we're gonna put it on our lower lash line. Okay, where's my eyeliner? Oh, found it. Okay, now we're gonna put mascara and I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Paris Voluminous Waterproof Mascara. I have no lashes. I wished I did, but I don't. Now we're going to put the same highlight we put on our cheekbones on the inner inner 
corner. <laughs> um, and yeah, I'm not going to wet this because I feel like, I don't know. Okay, for lipstick, what color should I use, you guys? I don't know what color. This is so, like, you know. Um, 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 um. I'm going to set my face with the Fab Fast and Fabulous 12 Hour Power Makeup Setting Spray from Heart Candy. I'm going to shake this up. Yes, I do shower on setting spray. I love setting spray. You guys, I really don't know what color to use. A red? Could I use a red? Should I do red? <laughs> Let's see how it looks. Red. Let's see. No. No red. No red. We're gonna go with nude, and then on my intro, we'll see what color I have on. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go do my hair off camera and I'll be right back. Alright guys, this is the finished look of the makeup look. Um, guys, I am so in love with this makeup look. I am so excited with this makeup look. This is my first time doing this makeup look for fall. First time ever and I can't get enough of this eye makeup look. Like... I am obsessed like I forgot to clean the the mascara I am totally obsessed with this makeup look I can't even tell you guys but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial this fall makeup tutorial fall welcome back I have missed you so much because summer has gotten on my nerves already it's been too hot lately and it just fall needs to get here like right now today it feels so good outside but for me it's still cold if you like this makeup look please leave um some fall leaves on the comments down below and please leave me recommendations of what else you want to see on my channel or if you want to see more fall makeup looks nice music on the background outside <laughs> so yeah um, I don't know if I said it, but please don't forget to subscribe before you leave, before you um, turn off your phone or your laptop or whatever, wherever you see my video from. And I have one more announcement. The other announcement that I have is that me and my husband finally have our own blog channel. And it's called, or it's named, Kimberly and Omar's Blog. Um, people can't find me, so... Um, for you guys to be able to subscribe to our blog channel I shared it on my snapchat and I shared it on my Facebook page so you guys can have it easy and be able to ooh, excuse me and be able to subscribe through there because I don't know how else to do this because people can't find me not even my husband can find the blog channel so I decided to share it on Snapchat and Facebook. So if you want to follow our blog channel, I'm going to leave my Snapchat and my Facebook page on the description box below so you guys can go check it out. There's no videos at the moment at all, but we're going to upload our first video on Saturday or Sunday. So hopefully it's a good video. 
a good vlog and hopefully you guys like it we are so beyond excited to take you guys around with us in our vlogs and so you guys can see everything that we do and the fun that we have and the amazing family that i have and that he has too so with that being said that's all i have to say no more announcement except that i love you guys and thank you so much for watching and i hope that you guys love this fall makeup tutorial look if you guys please give this video a thumbs up leave me um fall leaves on the comments below um follow me on my social media and i will be taking pictures and posting them on all my social medias so that's all i have to say so bye guys